At South Platte Renew, a wastewater treatment plant in the Denver area, an employee collects a sample of sewage water. It's done here daily. Yeah, so we take it right at the front end of the plant, so there's been no treatment process yet. Peter Van Rai is director of the facility. There are automatic pumps that pull right from where the influence stream is, and they pump the water out and stick it into a sample bottle that we then take to our lab and package up. Samples are sent to BioBot Analytics, a wastewater testing startup near Boston, which is busy examining sewage for presence of the coronavirus. I saw an article in Popular Mechanics and thought this would be an interesting possible study for us to participate in. 400 such facilities in 42 states across the country are now part of the effort. SARS-CoV-2 is shed in the stool of COVID-19 patients within three days of infection. By tallying genetic fragments of the virus, BioBot determines its concentration per liter of sewage and the density of infection in a certain community. It can quickly detect outbreaks. What we hope is that this information can complement existing epidemiological data to better understand when to reopen cities as well as an early warning system for the re-emergence of the virus. It turns out sewage can tell us a lot about public health. In fact, fecal tracking has been used to look for polio. It can reveal the presence of environmental contaminants and drugs. BioBot's discovery of opioids in sewage allowed one North Carolina city to do interventions. The company claims cut overdoses by 40%. It insists sample collectors are not at risk of catching the virus. And because wastewater is a mix of information, individual privacy will not be compromised. Its CEO believes sewage could become a key disease-fighting tool. She hopes that this type of technology will be used at scale in every city, every town, not only in the U.S., but in the world. Early findings show the coronavirus may be much more prevalent in the population than clinical tests show. 10% of all Americans, including 300,000 Coloradans who rely on this plant, are being studied now. I think we can always learn more from uh, wastewater than is probably immediately understood. Sewage can be very revealing and helpful perhaps in measuring the scale of this pandemic. Hendrick Sabrandi for CGTN, Englewood, Colorado.